Yeah, we definitely will. We are on a warming trend. Yesterday we were in the 50s. Today we got to the 60s. Tomorrow will be near 70 and then it goes downhill from there. Average high today, 63 degrees. We actually got to 65. A little bit cooler in the morning. Got down to 35 this morning when our average low is 46. The record high today, 83 degrees set back in 1979. By Wednesday, we could be talking about a different type of high temperature record. I'll get to that in just a second. Skyview right now looking over the Norfolk Botanical Gardens. They did have the lights out there for the million bulb walk. Those are now off a dark shot out there and a dark shot across the entire area, but it is clear overhead, so it's going to cool down just a bit, but we have southwesterly winds and what that means is it's filtering in some warmer air from the south and west, so that's going to stick around for our area tonight and tomorrow keeping us a little bit warmer than we have been over the past 24 hours for the night and then for the day as well. Off to the north and west, this area where you're seeing some rain and then a little bit of snow, that's going to be sagging down to the south into our area as we move toward the second day of the work. We can also toward the middle of the week as well. So we're keeping an eye on, yes, the potential for maybe the first few snowflakes of the season. 44, however, right now in Smithfield, it's 47 in Franklin, 44 in Hertford, 52 at Wallops Island, 49 in Wachapreek, and it's 53 for our friends in Hampton. Good evening to everyone. 44 tonight, mainly clear skies again with southwesterly winds. For Veterans Day, looking really nice to celebrate our vets. 70 degrees, sun and clouds, and that's quite warm for this time of year. So definitely great way to, to celebrate those who have served our country. Futurecast, let's jump ahead and let's talk about Tuesday. I've been talking about it all weekend and for the past couple of days. First of all, it's going to be breezy to windy out there. We're starting off the day with a mix of clear skies and clouds overhead. We stick with that until we get to the later parts of the morning. Here we are by 6 p.m. That rain knocking on our back doorstep that sags into our area along with a cold front by 1215. This particular computer model is starting to bring in some of the cooler air at least a little bit higher because you're seeing ground temperatures are in the 40s and 50s, but if the air is a little bit cooler below that 32 degree threshold, we could see some snowflakes mixing in, and I think that's what's going to be the story as we move through the middle part of the morning into the evening rush hour on Tuesday, because here we are Tuesday at 6 p.m., still with some showers down toward the south and could be some mixing with some wet snowflakes, and the temperatures also fall through the day, so it's not going to be until maybe later in the evening that we do get those temperatures below 32 degrees at the ground, so not talking about too much accumulation. So we do have that mixed potential for our area. Rainfall is likely some gusty winds and also wind chills possibly in the 20s and 30s. So the rain begins at, or the precip begins as rain and then starts to mix depending on when that cold air moves into the area. And we're also going to have falling temperatures through the day. Now I was talking about records. I'm talking about a record cold high temperature potentially on Wednesday. The coldest high temperature ever recorded at Norfolk International for November 13th, 42 two degrees and right now I've got a current forecast of 40, which if we do get to 40 degrees on Wednesday and that's it, we would set a new cold high temperature record. Just something to think about, but we have to get through Tuesday's event, falling temperatures, strong winds and possibly some snowflakes mixing oh in gosh. as we head toward the evening rush hour. We could be watching still some of that precip in the area. I'll be a little bit rough. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you so much.